Capricorn hello welcome back to my channel hope everybody is doing well all right Capricorn we're gonna go ahead and get started on an energy check-in for you we're gonna see what is the most important for you to know at this time please keep in mind it is general this collective so every message will not be for you check all your placements to see what spirit has for you we're just checking the current energy Capricorn short and sweet to the point if you're new here welcome if you're returning thank you for the love and the support all right, just because you're Capricorn, your messages could be in one of your other placements, Capricorn. Okay, so check your other placements or check all of them. All right. All right, Spirit, what do we have for Capricorn? What's going on? Rose and genders can be flipped around. Capricorn, put everybody where they go as it pertains to you. What we got for Capricorn? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Ancestor Spirit Guides. What do we have for Capricorn? What's going on? Current energy check-in for Capricorn. What's going on? Dang, Capricorn. What? What's up? Four wands with a judgment card? Ooh, you about to go into union with somebody. You about to go back into union with somebody. There's a union here. Justice card, three of cups. You about to reconcile with somebody. Some of you are. This could be a twin flame union. Some of y'all about to come into union with your twin flame. Moon card, strength card. Oh, my. Something is... Okay. Yeah, let's see. What's going on with Capricorn? Okay. You got the Prince of Wands. Somebody could be... Somebody could be coming to your work or sending a message to your work. They're coming to your work like this. You may meet this person at work or maybe you're on your lunch break. <laughs> OK. Somebody is attracted to you. You could be dealing with a fire sign. Somebody finds you attracted or you're attracted to someone Capricorn. Somebody wants to come out of the cold. Mm. Anyway, this could be somebody that you used to live with as well. Or you were just with them before in some way or something like that. Or you're meant to be with them. It's something like that. What we got for Capricorn? The Emperor? Yeah, you dealing with somebody. This Something has something to do with the Aries. The Four of Wands with the Emperor. Prince of Wands, King of Swords, Ace of Pentacles. Somebody sabotaged something. They sabotaged some gift or something like that. Or somebody's been cold or this is you. Something has something to do with, I mean, this person, this Aries or somebody who has a highly aspected. Okay, Capricorn. The number four could definitely be significant. What's going on with Capricorn? I mean, you really think somebody looks good or this Aries is like checking for you or something. Six of Swords, you're definitely coming to, coming into alignment. Yeah, this is this is someone being in separation. what's going on with you Capricorn it's a lot of fire in like the bottom of the deck like I don't know if you're just feeling fired up I don't I don't know just I mean maybe you're traveling some of you could be traveling something could have something to do with a destination wedding some of you could be eloping okay or you did okay Somebody who's in separation. This is someone who somebody's like twin or whatever you want to call it. Like somebody like it looks like they may have distanced themselves or misjudged the situation, ran off to marry somebody else. <laughs> That's what it looks like. Or you and this person are coming to union and y'all just not gonna people won't even know you get married. You're just gonna be like coming back and acting like you just date each other. So, um, I don't know. But yeah, there is a significant change here with the death card. With the devil. So Capricorn, what's up with you? The devil with the six of wands? 
somebody wants to like like cross watch or either you you want to just somebody wants to like put their feelings out there or stop lying about their feelings somebody wants to like say how they feel or something deals with the way somebody like somebody doesn't like know I'm not gonna say know how to love but they kind of like put passion and love in the same boat like it's the same thing I mean or something like that this person kind of toxic yeah somebody definitely has Capricorn highly aspect if something has something to do with your toxic this the so whoever this is this somebody like like lightweight lusting over somebody there's no cups out here <laughs> mm-hmm the only thing we see, though, is somebody that's in their feelings, though. Like, something, like, moves somebody to emotion. Somebody has overcome some kind of addiction here. Somebody could have had some kind of addiction that they had to overcome first with the devil and the six of wands here. And now they, they're, feel, they're actually feeling. I forgot. Somebody got that energy. Somebody's actually feeling now. Yeah, but... I don't get it. Capricorn, this is there's a significant change here. Current energy. Okay, you could be dealing with a Scorpio or an Aries. Or that's who you're, you know, there's a separation in play here. You're separating from this Aries for some of you. And you're gonna be with this Scorpio. You're separating from this Scorpio. You're gonna be with this Aries. It's something like that. Somewhere in the dynamic, there's somebody wants to come towards somebody. Okay. Or there's a decision being made about a major change or a commitment or something of the sort moving forward or whatever. Like this could be y'all going from like you and someone going from Capricorn. You could be seeing one of these energies and like you and this person are deciding to like go move on from like just a sexual connection to something a little bit more serious. Some of you could be... Um, for something, some of you, some of you are long distance from whoever this energy is that you're coming into alignment with. For others of you, it looks like you could be just kind of like a long distance relationship is more sexual based and y'all are going to like move to the same. Somebody's changing locations. I'm getting changing location here. And I come no downtime because it's all about location. Okay. I don't know what y'all got going on. Let me get one on the judgment card, though, for Capricorn. Somebody's moving. <laughs> the judgment. Or they want to. Like, somebody wants to relocate. The judgment card. They want to get close to you. Okay. Somebody got that energy. Okay. Um. Anyway, the judgment card is clarified by the two of cups with the page of swords. What I tell you, could be Libra. Libra's reading, cause Libra had like a full blown love reading or something. <laughs> For real, like the name of them, their reading is it must be love on the brain that has me feeling this way. Somebody doesn't understand like love. They just feel different or something. I don't know. Anyway, this person want to partner up with you. They want to come together with you. Like that's the final call that they're making in their head. They could want to message you, whatever this is, or they somebody wants to send you a message. Whoever this person is, this soulmate, this twin flame, whatever, that's the name of Libra's reading. Go watch it if you resonate with that. I don't know. If you have Libra highly aspect, this Scorpio or Aries, go watch it. Let me get one on the Emperor. Yeah, something is just meant, meant to be the Emperor. Or that's how somebody feels. Like, oh gosh, I'm meant to be with Capricorn. The Emperor... Or you feel this way about one of these energies. The Emperor is clarified by the Eight of Swords, okay? You got the Eight of Pentacles here. Eight or 88 could be significant. You got the Four of Pentacles, Six of Cups, Knight of Wands. Somebody left you out in the cold in the past, though, for sex. <laughs> or somebody they were dealing with sexually. Yeah. Look like it could have been somebody that likes to play with, you know, stuff. Yeah, but now they all like in love and like, oh no, I was lying to myself or I don't know. I just know somebody was sleeping on you and it just can't. Mm -mm. This 
this is very interesting. I haven't done Aries' this reading yet, so I guess stay tuned. I, I don't know what to say about this. Somebody got themselves trapped up, though. I don't know what was going on. Somebody really was, like, for real, for real. Somebody was trying to do some old witch poo or something, whatever. Like, they just wanted you locked in with them. Somebody could have trapped you. Somebody got trapped here with a kid. Feminine or masculine. Somebody got trapped. And I guess somebody thought that would be enough to, like, hold you back or keep you whatever. I don't know what this is. This is something past-related. Yeah, you could be dealing with somebody who's like obsessed with you. Like, anyway, so be aware of that energy. Somebody could be watching you, but, um, so you know, keep up, keep your stuff to yourself and things like that because it's just, I don't know, somebody's just a, addicted to you. Somebody that you had sex with. Somebody that you had sex with or you had some kind of sexual connection with, Capricorn, they are, like, addicted to you, like, in real life. Like, they just cannot, like, they can't shake the bug that they got on you. They just like, oh, God, I got to get me some Capricorn. Or take it how it resonates, <laughs> cross watcher. Let me get one of the dev card. I'm telling you, somebody has a, like, somebody, whoever somebody was partnered up with, whoever they're distancing themselves from is still stalking them. Like, they... <laughs> Let me get one of the death card. They, it's like they watching Capricorn. I'm pretty sure you are. Hopefully you know this, but it's some, somebody's partner that they were partnered up with, or that they tried to keep you, or like, or they wanted you to either be partnered up with them or stuck to them like glue. Like this could be like the baby mama, baby daddy attachment, or y'all live together, or it's, maybe it was just a partnership or a sexual connection. Whatever it is, somebody is actually watching the person that you're going towards. They're not only watching you, they're watching the person to see if you arrive on their end too. <laughs> That's funny. Look at this. Three of Cups. It's clarified by the Death card. This third party could be a Scorpio. <laughs> Death card at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, definitely a, skip, a Scorpio. Somebody is watching this change. This change is taking place. One way or another. Somebody may actually have to die. Ten of Wands. Two of Swords. Yeah, Six of Pentacles or go to jail. It's one of the two. I said that in who's reading. That was Patreon yesterday. But yeah. Something gonna have to happen to this person to like for them to like find something better to do. Um, cause it looks like they won't they they won't leave something alone. Whether it's you, whether it's your partner, whether it's just the thoughts of you. Like somebody is obsessed, like for real. Like I'm starting to think like the third party could legit be a Capricorn. For some people, could be. But I ain't gonna do you like that, Capricorn. It look like this three of cups is on this death card. So we're gonna let that be great. Okay. But the number four is definitely significant. You are protected. You and this person are protected. Whatever this is or was meant to be is protected. You guys are coming into alignment with each other. Um, or that's what that's what's happening here. I guess when somebody gets out of their head or somebody needed to get out of their head and uh take some kind of like charge or power, take their power back, reclaim their power. Or this is what happened. Like Capricorn, I don't know where you at in this whole like scenario because it's different for everybody. Some people are already in union. Some people are not. Some people are, aren't even close. Like, mm -hmm. but all I know is somebody just, let me get one more on this emperor. Somebody going to jail. Yeah. Let me get one on the emperor, please. Let me get one more on why this emperor is here. There's a significant change happening. Justice. They're going to jail. That's either your baby daddy. That's an Aries. That was a third party that changed something that made you feel some kind of way about somebody you were actually supposed to be in union with. Ten of cups, bottom of the deck. Three of swords, okay? Them or somebody in their family or somebody in your family, Capricorn. Or just this third party. Somebody you had a, a, a dynamic with. You had some kind of family dynamic with this third party this could be the family you're born into or the family you made okay but it does look like this with the justice and eight of swords here somebody is definitely going to jail and this could be some kind of somebody who wanted to control something they love being controlling they love being, because something is being seen about them about some kind of partner that they have or something to do with a third party 
who they dealt with, who they de who they who they dealt with, who they who they dealt with. Something that has something to do with somebody somebody's sexual partner, like who they chose to deal with is coming out, or the fact that they are is coming out. I mean, whoever this person is, okay. Ooh, but anyway, Capricorn. I mean, let's see. You got uh, Aries, Libra, uh, Scorpio. You can go watch those readings and see what you have there. And I'm going to leave it there. Please be sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Bye.